We now return to sports with Gary Radnich, brought to you by Jack in the Box. Yes, Jack in the Box presents Donald Foyle. Played 10 years for the Warriors, drafted in 1997. Uh, one of the all-time greats at Colgate. Uh, in fact, in the same draft as Tim Duncan, blocked nearly 1,200 shots, 3,500 rebounds. Part of the 2007 We Believe team, hails from the Caribbean, but became a U.S. citizen a few years ago. Calling the Bay Area home, I have to laugh. I was giving Donald credit. Hey, it's nice to see because most athletes don't want to pay the tax here. You know, you, you got some money so they want to move to Arizona or, or and I go to Donald it's nice that you stayed and where are you moving Florida Florida okay, well, anyway, no, it's, <laughs> no 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 but that's your mom is in the Caribbean yeah, and, and all there. that yeah no it's the Bay Area you can't beat the Bay Area you yeah. have to live here <laughs> hey, Steph Curry uh -huh. you, you understand basketball obviously how hurt is he because you can't get a straight answer out of him he's hurt I yeah. mean he doesn't want to use it as an excuse but he's hurt because if you look at what San Antonio has been trying to do they've been putting him on the skates trying to move him around have him run enough picks uh, he looks like he's hurt but he's gonna play all the way through it and he's not gonna complain all right, Mark Jackson and Popovich, uh, you know, Mark can really talk. I mean, he's a motivator. Uh, guys, like I said, with money and you've all played at a high level, can a coach still get through to you with words? I think what's amazing about this team is that they're so young. And, you know, Coach uh, Jackson's coming in at the right time with a young team. So he's able to ha insert his influence in them a little bit. And they will listen to him because they haven't been here before. Okay, fair enough. Let's get to your business. I love this when a guy just, uh, you know, just doesn't go hide or just jet set around the country you've got a golf tournament coming up the first Adano foil event yeah we have a golf tournament here June 17 so if anybody wants take it go to klfevents.com and you can sign up for Folsom or just come out and play and have fun with some of the celebrities in the Bay Area are you gonna come what's that <laughs> why not if you're moving to Florida <laughs> no I, I want to support local people this absolutely no, we always do stuff here there's a picture supposedly now on the left they cropped it out who's that next in the picture uh, you know it's the Tiger Woods uh, right Tiger was, you know. And you cropped him out? We roll like that. <laughs> well, no, 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 no. Oh, there it is. No, you know what Donald did? As soon as he got the wife on Thanksgiving, then he cropped him out of the picture. Now he's on top. You put him back in. That's terrible to work that way. No. Oh man, yeah. that's that's terrible camera work back yeah, yeah. there. Oh, you've got your two henchmen there. Terrible. Both you guys ought to be ought to be ashamed of yourself. But anyway, you got a website they can go to? Yeah, it's klfevents.com, okay. man. It's gonna be great. It's gonna be a great golf tournament. Here's the one though that I think is pretty cool. Mm. Two tall foil huh this is a children's book yeah <laughs> it's a center on kids who grow up too tall and you know it's about me growing up my autobiography yeah. is basically I just wanted to encourage kids to find a, their purpose find a sport find what they love to do and uh, you know fail a few times and uh, find success by finding what they love to do no this is really cool yeah. and they can get the book where uh, amazon.com they can go to Barnes and Noble or donaldfoil.com do this for Pam and I to share absolutely <laughs> you couldn't bring two I, I brought two <laughs> Yeah, no, no. Hey, nice to see you, young it's man. It's wonderful to see you. No, sir. no, you still got it. And people, people still like you. you know? um, I appreciate that. Yeah. I love the beer. It's always, it always will be home to me. All right. See you at eight. <laughs>